One of the things that is really great about Drupal is the ability to place information in the block regions or the sidebars of your website. Now in the old days, if we added a new event, we'd have to come out to our sidebar on every page that it's on and update the sidebar. Well, not anymore. As you know, Views updates your content automatically. So let's go to Structure and Views. And since we're coming back here a lot, I'm going to add it to my shortcut and add a new view. We're going to call this one Recent Events Added. So this is going to be the latest events we've added to our site. Once again, change content of type all to events. And this time, choose Create a Block. Once again, they're going to be sorted by newest first. Let's change the title to Recently Added Events, just to show that we can have a separate name and title. And once again, Drupal allows us to create different styles of views. We'll leave this as an unformatted list of titles with five in the block. We won't use a pager because we don't want pagination or page one of two, three of two, three of three, etc. at the bottom of our block. Click Save and Edit. Let's just take a quick peek at our preview. And indeed, it looks OK. It's just the titles of the most recently added events. Once again, display as a block. Format as an unformatted list. Fields are the title field. The filter criteria is published events in descending order of their publication date. Click Save. And now, as you might guess, this actually isn't going to show up anywhere, right? Because we haven't placed the block. So go to Structure, Block Layout, and let's place the block in the sidebar first region. Click Placed Block. And if you scroll down, you'll see the block called Recent Events Added. Click Place Block. Now, once again, we haven't gone over blocks in detail yet, so we'll just click Save, and it'll show up on every page. We'll edit that later. It's going to appear in the order after the search, so that's fine for now. Click Save Blocks. And if we go back to our site, instantly, we have a new block on every page that gives us the most recently added events to our site. You never need to touch this again. You can place it anywhere you want, and it will always be up to date. So that's an example of a block view using our events content type in publication date order.